Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Jake Smash. This is going to be a Watcher of Realms summoning video. It is 1022 Friday, January the 19th, and we are back on my friend Livewire's account. We are pulling for, hoping to get an A3 hex. A3 hex, really good. Let me show you why. Very, very briefly, we go to Awaken, A3. His A3, during the effect of Mad Truth, performing basic attack against targets inflicted with burning, extends the duration of Mad Truth by one second. So he basically just ults forever because he's putting burns out during his ult and it just keeps getting extended. So if this is phenomenal for any content you use him in, but specifically for Guild Boss, can really, really, really up his damage. So we're going to pull, uh, we're going to try and find a single gold on the Hex banner and then... Assuming we get one, we'll move over to the 2x banner because other than that, he's looking for an Elowin and an Ajax. Let's get to it. Fusion requirements met. No, I don't want to fuse. All right, let's start with... There we go. No gold. All right, here we go. So we're pulling everything. We've got 140 blues and 5,000 diamonds. Once we go through these... Uh, summons, we're going to sell off our blue champs, we're going to get more diamonds, we're going to keep going. So let's try to get that A3 hex. Let's see what we have. So we're going to have more than, oh, gold on the first one. Come on. Come on. What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, that is, that is not an A3 hex. That is the opposite of an A3 hex. Still a marksman, but not the one we're looking for. Let's take your 50 free diamonds. Oh my goodness. Skip. Ouch. Not what we... Double Lego. There we go. Hex. Yes. A3 Hex. Double Lego. First 10 pull. That's insane. Yes. There we go. There's the luck for the week. So exciting. So, so cool. So happy for him. Uh, congrats, buddy. Let's switch over to the 2X banner after this and see if we can get you that Elowin that you want. Man, that's fantastic. That is great. A3 Hex, super excited. I might actually awaken him and then play around uh, on his Guild Boss account. We'll see. That is so cool. So cool. I'm going to take a picture of this to send to him. There we go. Screenshot. Okay. Let's go to the 2X. Let's, let's see if we can get some more gold. Let's see if we can get an Elowin or an Ajax. Purple. So 200 plus summons are going to take a while. I'll uh, flip them over quicker if they're not going to be legendaries. But Salil. So Leo's a good champ. She can put out some really good magic damage. I used her to clear Infernal Faction Trials Stage 12. Let's see what we got here. Blue. Rare tax, right? That's okay. More diamonds to summon more champs. Man, I am I am so excited about that double Lego. Oh my gosh, gold again. Man, good day. Good day for Mr. Livewire. What do we got? What do we got? A nine. Okay. Recent addition to the game. Puts out lots of burns. Looks like he already has her, so I'm curious if that's an A1. She looks to be good for a future Immortal Codex boss. Let's do another 10. All right, so we got three Legos in, and we just got started. Yeah. Azoth. 80 more blues. Let's see what we got. There we go. Double epic. Neither one of them very useful. Rare attacks. More diamonds. More diamonds. That's what that'll give us. Epic. Uh, two, Lightlock, Daemon. Lightlock, not as good as he used to be, but still useful. <coughs> I am so sorry. Sort. 
just had a, a tickle in my throat that I it wasn't going away. Let's get some more diamonds, make some room, get some more legendaries for this man. Here we go. All right. What we got? Light lock again. Less useful. I don't think Mr. Livewire needs him. More purple. Nisalt. I just used Nisalt to clear Esotericist stage 12 without any legendaries. Puts out decent DPS damage. If you don't have the really OP, you know, Comet, Boreas types. More epics. Another Nisalt. Let's see what we got. Come on, come on. We're looking for that that tiny Mariel and Voroth. Not really useful. The the small cube in the bottom left, if that spins slower than normal, that's indication that it'll be a legendary. If you did not know that. Harpoon, pretty useless. Let's get rid of blues. There we go. I'm going to make room for all of them so we don't have to keep doing this. There we go. No extra nine there. All right. Diamonds it is. We can get another, another legendary. 6,000, not nine greens. That hurts. That's all right. There's nine blues. Let's see if we can get our single. I'll skip the animation since we're just doing singles. I know that takes a lot of time. There's no point in spending the same amount of time for nine singles that you would spend on nine ten poles. So we are hoping for a single gold in here. Cutter. Cutter. Funny story again. I released a video to use Cutter on um, Piercer's Faction Trial Stage 12. If you don't have any magic damage, he puts out poisons. He can really help you with the tanks in that stage. You can also use him to great effect in gear raid three if you're struggling. So useful uncommon champs. Hayden. Three more singles. We'll finish off our ten pulls. Calypso or Mari? Mari. I always get those two confused. They both start out in the water. Mari's great. Mari's a fantastic champ. Really, really, really useful in Gear Raid 1. Slowing down, freezing. But she can be used really well in a lot of, a lot of content. She has amazing crowd control. If you have not built her, build her. Last single before we get back to our 10s. There we go, 10 pull. All right, so we'll probably have six here. And then, whoops, I didn't mean to skip that, I'm sorry. We'll let this play out because we don't know what it's gonna be. I apologize. Here's another 10 pull. So we'll have about five more here and then more blues. And then we'll sell some more blues and probably get another one out of it. Come on, we started out hot. We started out hot, what is going on? We need to end with a bang. That's what we need to do. Not three blue ten pulls in a row. That is not how we want to end this. We want to end with a bang. Let's go. Epic. Edril, fantastic champion. If you don't, if you haven't built her, build her. She will be your MVP in Gear Raid 3, in Faction Trials. You can use her effectively in Void Rift. Very, very useful. Misande. All right, we're getting close. We're running out of diamonds. There, oh, so close. We need, we need one more. We need one more legendary. We started so hot. All right, looks like we need to sell our blue champs 
to get some more, whoops, I apologize, heroes, sell, dismiss. That's not quite enough for two tenfolds, but if we get his rewards, there's one, he said, he said pull everything, whatever you got. So we'll get his rewards. There's more gems. So we can pull some more there. And then what do we have here? A few more gems. Ooh, and a gold too. All right. Summon. Let's finish this off. We need, we need one more legendary. I'm going to save that gold summoning crystal for the very end. There we go. Epic. Let's get our 10 pulls. We need another one. Come on. Come on. Hollow, fantastic champion, will increase rage. You can use her to great effect in all content, especially guild boss. If you haven't built her, build her. This one's slow. Legendary. Last one. What is it? What is it going to be? Come on. Maybe we'll get another double. Oh, it doesn't look like it. There we go. What is it going to be? Nocturne. Nocturne puts out some great magic damage. You use him very, very effectively in... You can use him in Guild Boss or in Faction Trials. Not super meta champ, but definitely usable. we go okay so we did get another one there we go and then let's get one more here let's let's come on let's get one more legendary no nope, spinning too fast continue there we go let's double check his rewards make sure he has everything sam hello sam yeah, he's definitely way over that. He got a bunch of legendaries. Well, congratulations, sir. Uh, super, super happy for you for getting your A3 hex. Uh, stick around. I've got another viewer summons coming up after this. You'll have to deal with uh, two intros because I'm still learning how to uh, organize and tie together my videos. So I apologize for that. But thank you so much for your time. I hope you have an excellent weekend and good luck with your summons. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Jake Smash. This is going to be a Watcher of Realms summoning video. It is 0907, Friday, January the 19th. And let's go discuss very briefly who we're summoning for. So there is a 10x banner currently in game for Hex and Fursi. Fursi is a new healer. Hex is an excellent champion. And we are pulling today, trying to get an A3 Hex. The reason that we want A3, uh, this is on my friend the Nothings account. He already has an A2 Hex, he wants 3, and this is why. Awaken 3, during the effect of Mad Truth, performing basic attack against targets inflicted with burning extends, extends the duration of Mad Truth by 1 second. So Mad Truth is his ultimate. So... When he's doing his ultimate, he's placing burns, and every time he attacks, which is very quick during his ultimate, uh, it extends the duration, so his ultimate stays up so long. This is massive for any content, uh, but specifically Guild Boss, where he really shines. So, the nothing has given me explicit directions to pull everything to try to get Hex. So we're going to start with the... Oh, uh, what could be our, our luckiest first, right? So we've got two golds. Hopefully we will get lucky right here and we won't have to burn through his blues or his diamonds. Let's go. Okay, there's a purple Theowin. Let's get 50 free diamonds. Perfect. One more. Let's see. Nope. Okay, Medan, excellent healer, not who we're looking for, though. So let's go to our blues. We have 59 and 4,300 diamonds. This is hex, A3 hex, or bust. No gold on the first 10 pull. 
We got a Sirene. Useful in a couple niche places for um, building up cost. Three Epics, another Sirene. Uh, she must be part of the, no, she's not. Theo in there, but Sirene is not part of the 10X. Now it's important, right? This is only a 10X banner. It's not a 2X. Normal rates are still the same. So we have a 0.46% chance of getting a legendary. And at that point, there's a, a 10 times rate for both Hex and Fursi. So we've got 29 left before we start dipping into diamonds. What do we got? Nope, no purples. Let's get that. Solil. Solil is actually useful. She puts out some good magic damage. I used her to clear um, Infernal Stage 12. Blues. We're not going to waste time waiting for all of those to uncover. They're not exciting. Let's start using diamonds. After this one, I'll check to see if he has... Enough over here for to get another 10 pull. Nope. Where is that? Oh, he'd have to do a bunch more. 62, 60. He's not going to get there. Let's do the singles. That way we don't use diamonds. I'll skip those since we're doing singles. I'll save you some time. We're going to skip the animation since we're doing singles. That takes, that takes too long. Get out of here. There's an epic... Good points for the event. Come on. Let's do this. Gonkba. I just used Gonkba to help clear Esotericists Faction Trial Stage 12 without any legendaries. Go check it out. It's fun. Gonkba. Two more singles. No. Nope. All right. And another Thaewin, part of the 10X. All right, back to Diamonds. Come on. I have no idea where he is in regards to Pity. So let's see. He is all in, though. So once we use these Diamonds, if we haven't gotten Hex, we'll go sell our Blue Champs in order to get um, some more Summons. Damon. Let's see. No luck so far. Man. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Maul is fantastic. Hollow is fantastic. Hollow, great at building rage. If you don't have her built, build her. She can help you in literally all content to build rage for your DPS champs. Man. No gold. Theowin, Isolda. Oh, we got a Lord. That's cool. Good points there. Let's see if we get any summons from any of these. Okay. We've got a couple here. He's all in. So we're going to get his bunch of stuff there. 600 diamonds. Okay. Whoops. Sorry. I already went to the event hall. Anything to summon here? Nothing to summon there. All right, let's sell some blues. 1100. All right, so that'll get us two more 10 pulls. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. All right, and this will be the last one. Fingers crossed. We've got two blues that we can pull after this. Man. One. Cyclone. I used Cyclone in Esotericist also. Useful champ, Titus. Used him in Infernal 12. A lot of champs that can be useful. 24. Is there a way to get six more summons here? Not there. 
don't want to spend that. I don't think that's what he wants. Nothing there. I think that's it, ladies and gentlemen. I think that is it. He said all are bust, so we can do, looks like, three more summons. Three more. Selkath getting lots of epics. Great epic rate, but epics are not what we want. Oh, man. The last one. Well, we weren't able to pull it off. He is three away from getting nine free ones. So maybe he'll get lucky there over the weekend. He'll get those three, I'm certain, and he can do another 10 pull. So uh, I'm sorry I couldn't get you that A3 hex, uh, sir, but uh, I tried. Thank you so much for your time. If you appreciated this video, I will see you in the next one.